Hi friends, welcome back on the RC channel. In today's video, we are going to discuss the Indian AS 107. This Indian AS basically deals with the disclosure of the financial instrument into the financial statement of an entity. The applicability and role of the Indian AS 107 are already discussed while discussing the Indian AS 32. So guys, if you watch this video first time, then I recommend you please watch our previous video that is based on the Indian AS 32 and Indian AS 109 and to watch that videos please click on the iCard button or link of such videos are also provided into description box please go there and watch that video before watching this video because this video are basically depend on Indian AS 109 so friends under Indian AS 107 provision with respect to disclosure are provided and now we are going to discuss that provisions guys Indian AS 107 is a very small Indian AS as compared to Indian AS 32 and Indian AS 109 so guys Indian AS 107 provides that entity disclose the importance of the financial instrument for such entity so guys financial instrument are basically includes the financial asset financial liability and equity instrument while disclosing such financial instrument entity must disclose the benefit of such financial instrument to such entity and guys next disclosure is all risk related with such financial instrument are also disclosed in Indian AS as per Indian AS 107 and one more disclosure required by such entity is that it also disclose the risk arising from such financial instrument and entity also discloses the planning to tackle such risk so guys under Indian AS 107 first of all we disclose the financial instrument then risk related with such financial instrument and remedies in the hands of the entity friends the provision of the Indian AS 107 are correlated with the Indian AS 109 because Indian AS 109 provides the provision with respect to the recognition of the financial instrument measurement of such financial instrument and it also provides the derecognization of such financial instrument so guys Indian AS 107 require the disclosure with respect to the basis of the recognition and derecognization of financial instrument and that financial instrument are basically includes the financial asset financial liability and equity instrument under Indian AS 109 we are understand the measurement of the financial instrument based on the various methods like fair value measurement through profit and loss fair value measurement through other income and last is measurement at amortized cost and this basis of the measurement shall also disclose under the Indian AS 107 and guys Indian AS 107 also require the disclosure related with the initial and subsequent measurement that is already discussed under Indian AS 109 so guys I recommend you please watch the video based on the Indian AS 109 because all these provision are discussed in such video so guys this is our Indian AS part and that is cover under the study note number 5 of paper number 17 of the CMA final please share this video with your friends so that they can also get benefit from this video so guys thank you for watching the video